Hello friends, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. So this is another video of instrument control using that view. Uh, today in this video, I will try to show you some basic measurements using nano voltmeter. How we can use nano voltmeter in our research work. Recently we have brought a nano voltmeter and this is again from uh, Ethle and its model number is 2182A. Uh, it has uh, it can measure two channels simultaneously and i have connected uh, this nano voltmeter with uh, gpib to, to my laptop so in this video we will basically see how it it can communicate with our uh, computer using labview program so i am switching on i i did not have connected anything with this instrument it's lead here and i'm switching on it also i'm powering on my laptop It is showing some readings in, in millivolt. Okay. You know, it, it is some offset voltage that uh, it is very low, as you can see, it is around uh, 60, 60 millivolt, 60 to 70 millivolt. So, what I will do, I will first try to see how it can communicate with my computer with with labview program and then we will take some small measurement of voltage or temperature so uh, basically it is a nano voltmeter that it can measure uh, voltage precisely up, uh, after you know uh, nine place to decimal Okay, another my first thing is I will try to see whether it communicates with my computer or not. So I will just open an example of GPIB. this this is example of uh, gpib so first i will need gpib address for my instrument so on uh, pc on its front panel then it is uh, gpib is written here so we have to check its gpib address for the communication so i will press shift and then gpib so it's it's showing it's a gpib and it is on and then gpib address is 07 so i will put 07 here uh, 7 and then i will try to run this program so as you can see that the information about the instrument are here so it properly communicates with uh, labview program now i am sharing my screen for the rest of part now uh, i will open a new vi okay uh, this is block diagram of my new vi and uh, i will pin here the visa palette obviously visa is important for some kind of programming there has to be a visa open and then visa write 
and uh, I'll also need a visa read and uh, then we need to close all the things for this there is a visa close <coughs> and uh, now I don't need this palette Just make it control to select instruments and then connect to this visa open to visa right okay uh, here I have to give commands so you, you can find commands in if uh, you know manual for the instrument but you know for kitly commands are very easy and uh, you know applicable for all the instruments with gpib connections so first i need to reset restore its defaults so for this the command is star r e s t in capital actually r f t this command restore all the defaults of instrument and, and then again i will copy this okay uh, then i need to select the function which measurement i want so i want to measure uh, voltage so the command for uh, selecting voltage as a sense function is semicolon s e n s s e n s and function f u and c volt v o l t so uh, with this command the sense function is set to volt like it, it will measure voltage and uh, then we need to select the channel by which we want measurement so uh, for this we can we can put another right palette or we can write the same command in this so we can separate two commands by using this semicolon and uh, then we write another command for sense channel i will use first channel then you know uh, I have if I want to set range uh, then we can paste another command otherwise it is okay uh, it will it is this its default is auto range so it is okay it, it can work here uh, then we want to read the data measured by instrument so what I will do just put another write visa right and then and here the read command we have to instruct the instrument to read the measured data right. r e a t question mark and here you can obtain data as a buffer like 1024 any bit you want you can write and then here it's a indicator voltage it's, it's done uh, you can see in our front panel here visa resource and here we get measurement the, you know uh, i'm making this program for measuring voltage it it can also be make in the same way for temperature measurement so this i will run this program and track it's running so uh, there is an error so oh, 
what happened just we, we didn't select any instrument for this program so we need to select first here oh, the instrument it is not showing so i will switch on instrument make sure the, the instrument is connected with your computer and it is switched on so uh, you may see we have to select a uh, visa resource name and then i will try to run this program uh, it is working it is seems okay uh, so it is giving us some reading like you can see so negative of around 64 millivolt 6.4 into 10 to the power minus 2 and uh, 